living a constant divine love song. That's the name of the program I invite you to live. And that's when I live. That's the life of my heart and the heart of my life. And to live a constant divine love song with every conscious breath, every meditation, every swimming of my thoughts floating in an ocean of bliss and there is this inner love song, divine, nothing to do with materialistic love which is insignificant compared to divine love which gives the real bliss of the soul mm, way beyond pleasure of mind and body and it's much more than mantra meditation where you repeat a mantra it is like a love song that flows incessantly you don't have to try to get it it is always there already there just have to be conscious of it and the rest of the day flows from that flow even when you're not chanting and you're doing activities it is in the flow of that love so your ordinary activities like even going to the toilet what to speak of working helping others getting food to cook out of love all activities are part of that flow of divine song of love and Sanskrit it is called Siddha a perfection of life the highest yoga is union in love. Yoga means union with divine absolute and full union, closest union is in divine love. And when there is a constant divine song of love in our heart, that is the deepest, most complete union. Is the goal? of yoga vedanta meditation not the physical yoga the real yoga i spoke about union with the supreme this is the goal of all the deepest spiritual traditions and religions may they be muslim christian buddhist hindu deep connection of divine love in Sanskrit, um, great sage will say, Prema Pum Artha Mahimas. The greatest good, the greatest benefit, the greatest thing one can achieve in life is Prema, pure divine love. Free of materialistic, egoistic love. Does it mean we don't love any material person? No. Material person are loved even more. Anything enters into that oceanic flow of divine love more respect more real respect to everyone not just a limited sexual love or family love no there can be sexual or family love but they are part of the flow of the divine love and how do we know that we are really flowing in that divine love is when we have this constant song of divine love in our heart. That's what I live, that's why my teachers live. Mm, took me many, 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 many years of love and service and hearing and training from my teachers to get this. And this is what I want to provide with very systematic program. Now, systematic doesn't mean technique. It's not about breathing and posture to achieve this 
state of constant song. It is an exchange of bhav, spiritual emotion, that comes by spiritual interaction. And spiritual means based on service. I've seen so many disciples, they come and they want to abuse the teacher by ordering him, give me the knowledge now. It's much more than knowledge. Consciousness is much more than knowledge. And loving divine consciousness is so much more than action or knowledge. In fact, most desire for knowledge and most desire for action are covering blockage, obstacles on that path of pure divine love. It's a very specific path and this program is for very specific people who want that very rare gem which is the real spiritual perfection. And our program is based on many types of small introductions by which you can meditate on this truth and see the importance of it and maybe one day you want to jump in that flow. And we have many different levels of initiations according to the different level. You are ready to go. You are ready to get involved with. How much divine love are you ready to receive, cherish, digest, swim into in your life? This is your decision what level you want to go. So, it's much more than techniques. It's about exchange of heart and that's why the basic principle it is um, interaction and this interaction can be done very very nicely through the internet wherever you are you can participate into this program and we also have many other programs where you can come and visit us in Asia or I come to visit your group there is many different ways by which this program can can grow but the basic principle is an interaction interaction based on love and service love comes from love and it starts with love which shows <coughs> by an attitude of respect and service and this is a very practical program practical meditation and based on experience you can gain one experience after another 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 living experience to come to the living of this constant divine love song pouring from your heart and one of the most simple practical way for you to attain this practical state of consciousness is we're going to discuss the life and teachings of many sages, saints, scholars from many traditions. It's non-sectarian universal principle of love and the religion of love. There is no member or non-member. Who can say, oh, I'm not part of the religion of love? Everyone wants to be part of love. And that's the nature of love to accept everyone. There is no sectarian vision. These, is, these are the words of the great um, Sufi mystic Rumi. And we're going to exchange and share many, many of his words. Just like in India, Raghunath Das Goswami, Rupa Goswami, Mirabai. So many saints of so many different traditions of India. What to speak of these wonderful Christian saints. All over the world, we gone meditate on their words, which is part of the great song of love. Every word of those immersed in that ocean of love are part into that great song of love that will become the flow of our heart. The great, great, great... Uh, Bernard de Clairvaux, 11th century in France, 
he constructed so many monasteries and he said, Amo kia amo. This is Latin. I love because I love. No techniques there. No material affinity and that's the greatest thing although we are eternal soul into this temporary world we can achieve eternal benefits and that divine love is eternal benefit it won't go away we might die the body might go but this divine love remain with us life after life and when it grows sufficiently then we don't need to take another material body we remain in the eternal realm of love. No need to learn anything more. No need to suffer more material bodies. That's one of the many, many reasons why this divine love is the highest benefit. And that's what we want to share. That's why we have this these programs. And The spiritual practice, which you can do wherever you are. Uh, we have a highly customized one-on-one -on -one presentation. And of course, also group activities like the study of the life of these great saints. I've been teaching on the internet for six, seven years now. And it's a wonderful way to teach. I already have hundreds of videos of teaching there. And in French language, I have hundreds and hundreds of hours of teaching. This will come in English also. We can use all of this in our program to achieve the highest goal, the highest benefit, the highest spiritual eternal benefit of pure divine love that manifests very practically in our life, changing every moment as a constant song of divine love.